Hey guys, what is up? It's me, Krishna. How are you guys doing? Welcome back to another video. Today is gonna be a video about beauty or skincare, and we're gonna be talking about this overpriced soap that I feel like it's just not worth the hype, not worth the money, and it's a marketing scam. If you guys wanna know why I feel like this is a marketing scam right here, then please keep on watching. All right, you guys, welcome to my channel. I am Christian Liesi, I am a beauty vlogger from the Philippines. I currently have five YouTube channels. This is the beauty and skincare, well, hello. Welcome to this YouTube channel of ours. Yes, I call this ours because this is a collaborative effort. You guys tell me what you want and I'll tell you my opinions about it. Basically guys, I am a video blogger that talks about technology, mukbang, travels, beauty and skincare, which is this channel, and of course, how to tech. I also have a main vlogging channel where I vlog almost every day and I post it every single week. And of course, I know you guys are here because of this stupid soap, then please, Let's start. First of all, I got this one from Galleria Watsons. Yes, I love Watsons, but this one, I don't think so. Oh, and there's a hair inside. Not, oh my god, maybe that's not my hair. No, it's probably my hair. Either way, you guys, this is 249 pesos for one soap. Um, first of all, I used this one for two weeks already, going three. It says on the packing jig that it's supposed to skin white. It's very understandable, make your skin white, but it didn't whiten my skin, I do not know. It says it is a whip soap, correct? I feel like when you use the soap, when you lather it up like this, it makes like a whip, foamy whip. Try imagining the texture of a shaving cream. That's the same texture of the whip soap like this. You feel like there's bubbles all over your face, all over your hands, and you feel relaxing using it. But really, you guys, it's a freaking stupid soap. I'm so pissed. I spent 249 for this. And they say this is very innovative. No, this is not innovative. This is stupid. Fine, this is innovative, but it's not new, bitch. <laughs> like, are you are like, are we stupid? And weeks ago, when Chris Aquino endorsed this one, when she was still okay, should I say? I mean, I'm a fan of her. Like, I I'm a fan of her. Like, she said it's the kakaubusan to market. That's why we need to get or we need to hold the soap now since it's available. And I felt like that was a an effective marketing strategy for us people. Now we feel like, oh my god, it's really effective because it's kakaubusan, so let's buy it. And oh my god, it's 249 pesos. It's that mahal, but people are nagkakaubusan, so let's buy it again. So like, bitch, 249 pesos for a whitening soap that doesn't even whiten your skin. And of course, if you feel like, I mean, high skin white, whitening snail something, I don't know. The only thing that made me buy this one is when Mimia and Eric Gonzalez introduced it. Like, fine, this, you can say this is innovative, but let's all be honest, it's not new. Like, hindi naman lahat ng soap may ganito. But it doesn't give you the excuse to overprice the soap. How much is this on Alibaba? 3 pesos, 5 pesos. Mass produced. Two pesos. So, regular freaking whitening soap that doesn't even, you know, whiten your skin. And, and people also say the packaging is very innovative because it closes up. No, it's not innovative. It's not new. It's old. It's just, it's cheap packaging. For 249 pesos, I expect a soap that has their own hard plastic cover, soap cover, something. You know, like something, something like this that you get from Watson's where you use it to place your soap. How much is this? 15, 20 pesos? 
for this one for 249 pesos and Arish Gonzalez, Mimia, and Chris Aquino endorsing this one. I was expecting a lot. I was expect I was expecting this to be whitening. I was expecting this to whiten my skin in 15 days or three weeks, but it didn't. It only gave me pimples. I don't know why. I always tell myself no, it's skin purging, or maybe you lack sleep, or maybe you don't drink enough water, or maybe you need more vegetables or not eating enough, but bitch. The past few weeks, I have been drinking, sleeping enough, drinking water enough, sleeping enough since I'm a freelance video, you know, creator. So I have time to sleep. I also eat vegetables and fruits. Like this past three day, three weeks, I can really say that there is no way this has an excuse of not working on me. Like, I don't know, well, you guys can see that I am white. That's because I'm using a high coverage foundation and concealer. I baked my face. This is not glass skin. This is highlighter. And this is the bumps that it left from this one. Fine. Do what? No, hindi pa din. Stupid talaga siya. It's very overpriced. And I feel like it's very overhyped and hindi na much effective. I'm sorry for the maker of this one. You're too OA. You're too dramatic for 249 really really girl well yeah and also I don't like the fact that they put white and white and skin white and snail white and it didn't whiten my skin it is not effective it is overpriced it is overhyped and I got fooled. This is stupid. Don't ever buy this one. Do not ever buy this one. Hey, nako. Hey, nako. Just another stupid brand in the market that's trying to, you know, get our dollar peso bills. Either way, you guys, that's my video for today. If you're thinking of buying it, go waste your money on that. But I'm telling you, it's a bad idea. It's not effective. It's stupid. It's overpriced. It's overhyped. And do not forget that on this channel, I'm gonna be 100%. If I'm a, if I'm gonna sound harsh, then probably because I'm I'm harsh because I know the feeling of buying something overpriced and super expensive and it doesn't work and video bloggers or influencers keeps on saying na parang it works so much and I've been using this for three months bitch you got the PR two weeks ago like no again this is only for honesty and credibility and 100% honest truth either way you guys thank you so much for watching the video and I'll talk to you guys on my next one goodbye